Just give me the fairy, fairy, fairy shit with a bunch of fairy shit in it. Sprinkle some fairy shit in it. Put it in a fairy environment with a bunch of fairies around doing fairy shit on their fairy laptops. Thanks. Now walk away, fairy. Ladies and gentlemen, come to the stage, which is where it belongs. Very funny guys on the HBO show Lucky Louie. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for Rick Shapiro. What club is this? Oh, okay. I didn't know. I got rid of the sign. How you doing, you big fuck? Standing with your beer in your hand, your big basement-looking eyes. Like you play Xbox instead of eating ass. Listen, you get that? No, oh, man, it's gonna be a bad fucking set. <laughs> hey, I don't understand that nappy-headed hoe shit. I thought he was talking about Obama. <laughs> no, because he's a politician. All right, anyway. Uh, let's start slow. I had to do a clean set. Uh, I, I had a crazy life. Like, I found God, right? Can, can you tell by the scowl on my face? I believe in God now. <laughs> Alright? I feed ducks. You know? You ever try to feed ducks and you realize they're full of shit? <laughs> no, because I... I'm trying... No, no, don't laugh like that's not true. I'm trying to do normal shit. I'm trying to relax, you know? I'm tired of my morning habits. I hop and then a hooker, you know? I, I go uh, I go, I go to feed ducks and I'm always in a bad mood. Like, I start trying to... I'm trying to relax, you know? So I go and I'm going like... <laughs> like a normal guy, you know? And they waddle away in fear. And, uh... And then I started getting mad, like I started getting mad, I was like, Come on! Come on, you see me! Bullshit! Uh, like that? Eh? And then, uh, and then I started becoming the, like the five-year-old who shouldn't be allowed around small animals, you know? I started throwing lit matches at them, and I started going, Ah, fucking quack, quack, quack! You don't support the troops. All right. <laughs> you didn't know I had a punchline hidden in my little hat there. Don't I look like an angry Jewish Chihuahua? Like, <laughs> that was Paris Hilton's dog impression. I study celebrities so I can care about people I don't care about. All right, good. So, uh, Hillary and Obama, you're not going to catch my good shit tonight. Listen. No, here's what I want to talk about. I don't want to talk about I, I was in the... You ever, you ever sit in a car with a guy who talks louder and more deliberately than any person you've ever met? I'm with a guy who talks really slow, like, Yeah, I went over there, and then we went over there, and then we stopped in over there, and then we went over there. And I looked at him and I said, You gotta take a shit, you know? In fact, that leads me to my ne next joke. Uh, you ever get so bored of shit, like, the world's too gay now, you know? I don't need a good kind of gay where a guy goes, Hey, Mike, come over here, shove it in. You know what I mean? I mean, it's like a Grey's Anatomy gay, you know? It's gay without the ass fucking, you know? It's, it's like, you can't even watch Grey's Anatomy without becoming gay. You, you know, you ever hear two men talk about, like, you know, watching Grey's Anatomy? It's like having a cock shoved up your ass automatically. You know, even when I go to Starbucks, I don't even fucking order anymore. I go, ah, just give me the fairy, fairy, fairy shit with a bunch of fairy shit in it. Sprinkle some fairy shit in it. Put it in a fairy environment with a bunch of fairies around doing fairy shit on their fairy laptops. Thanks. Now walk away, fairy. Here's a joke you won't get. Oh, that's what you're thinking. You got like a buzz going in your cock. Don't try to drink like you're gay. Don't you hate dating? Isn't it bullshit? We shouldn't be sitting far away from each other. We should be sitting with our cocks in the vagina, you know? <laughs> like, cut the bullshit. Cut to the chase.